Hi, I'm Vince Borg, the owner of Box Hill Speech Pathology. Today, Sarah and Rochelle will be talking about what actually happens in a teletherapy session. The type of therapy depends on lots of different factors, including a person's age, their speech or language concerns, as well as their goals. Here at Box Hill Speech Pathology, we have speech pathologists who work across a range of areas and each speech pathologist tailors their approach to each and every client. Today, we're going to give you just a few examples of what your speech therapy session might look like. Can you make your tongue come out, please? And can you point it towards your left ear? Can you grab a glass of water and just give me a swallow of that? We'll do this a few times. Great, okay. All right, so our next word is chin. This is my chin. So let's think about how many sounds we can hear. Ch, i, n. All right, three sounds. Okay, ready? This time we're just gonna make the sound like this. Ready? K, k, k. You try again. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. All right, you ready? We're gonna try some words with the k sound now. Um, um, castle. Oh, that was an awesome k sound. Okay, castle. All righty. So is she saying a word like, um, like uh, Teddy? <laughs> then what you can do is, is add another word to that, preferably a verb, to make that sentence a bit longer. So if she says Teddy and you can say, oh, Teddy go, or Teddy's jumping. And, and then you can have your Teddy and he can be jumping around like that. Can you see the drawers in the next picture? Which drawer yes. will he get his pants from? The middle one. Have you been doing your Lipcomb practice daily? Have you been able to get yeah. 15 minutes in every day? Yeah, it started off as a bit of a struggle, but now we've got it into a really smooth routine and working really well with him. Oh, great. And so um, what activities have you been doing for the past week? Um, just reading stories and then talking about stories, so reading books. Yeah. Um, we did a scavenger hunt of it over Easter and talked about the eggs and the colours and the oh, sizes. Oh, great. That sounds um, fun. And we did the puzzle and talked about pictures that were, or images that were on the pictures of the Oh, fantastic. Puzzle. That's some great different activities and great because you can work on the sentence level, which is where Jackson's at right now. So that's, that's fantastic. Yeah. All right, so now we're going to watch a little bit of this video. And what I want you to think about is how the two aliens might be feeling and what they might be thinking. So we want to work out whether they're thinking the same thing or whether they're thinking different things. All right, let's have a look at his face. Hmm, it looks like he's putting his hand up like that. I wonder if he's asking a question there. 